The next section is monomer and polymer over tip service. Please apply a nail tip and monomer and polymer overlay on one nail. You have 32 minutes to complete this section. You'll be informed when you have 16 minutes remaining. You may begin. All right, you guys, so for this part of the test, most likely you'll be working on a small manicure table that will probably be uh, directly pretty much close to where you'll be doing um, all the other services on your mannequin. So once you have your bag ready, go over to the table. You will start off by sanitizing your station first. So you will be using your EPA and obviously either a towel or a napkin to clean your station before you get started. This is definitely the first step, okay? Make sure that you do clean the chair entirely and your station. All right, you will then continue to getting all, all of your things that you'll be needing for the service. They give you 32 minutes for this part of the test. So there's a small trash bag that, that should be inside of your bag, so make sure that you tape it really well to the side of your table. All right, once you have your bag tape, you can then throw away the napkin that you use to sanitize your station in there, and then you can continue to set up the manicure table. Getting everything out in front of you is always helpful. Makes everything a lot easier and obviously visible. Okay, so once you're done putting everything out, the big bag can actually be placed somewhere on your station because by the time you're done, you will be putting everything back inside of that bag. All right, you guys, so make sure that you know how to set up the table properly, okay? And making sure that everything that you'll be using is out to the side, all right? And that you do put a towel on your lap. And then we also have paper towel, our cotton, our EPA, cuticle oil, and of course, everything that we'll be using inside of this container there, all of our implements, okay? All right, so just to show you guys what's inside, uh, we have our powder, our odorless powder, dehydrator, low odor primer, and our odorless monomer, okay? You have your little depping dish, your little nail with your glue, okay? All right, let's start.
All right, you guys, so for the purpose of the video, I will be reading you guys the steps, but just to know that the day of the test, they will not read you the steps during your exam. All right, so we have set up our manicure table. We've sanitized our hands. So right now we are buffing the natural nail gently to remove the shine, okay? After this step, we are going to gently push back the cuticle with the cuticle pusher. One thing that I do want you guys to keep in mind that um, before you go in to opening any containers, you have to sanitize your hands. Okay. This is something that you guys definitely have to practice, all right? You're not, you're going to be nervous if this will be the very first time you do this, okay? So practice the steps, do it in order so that you're more comfortable the day of the test. Okay, once we have pushed our cuticle back, we are now going to select the nail tip that fits to the natural nail. After selecting the nail tip that fits the natural nail, we will then apply nail dehydrator. We will then continue to apply adhesive to the well of the tip that you have selected. We will then slide the tip on by positioning the tip against the free edge. Make sure that you're rocking the tip into the nail plate. Make sure that you take your time, that it's on there good and glued properly. Okay. All right, we will now move on to trimming it. You guys remember to sanitize your hands, all right, before opening any jars. Let's sanitize our hands. Okay. We're now blending the tip into the natural nail plate. Once you have it nice and blended, we will then apply primer. So 
So we are now applying our primer. Now, if you know you need to let certain things sit for a few seconds, even a minute or two, do that, okay? We are working with orderless products and we know that they do take a little longer to dry. So don't feel like you need to speed through this. They do give you 32 minutes and that is a long time. Okay, we're now going to start with the polymer and monomer. So we're reaching over for our brush kind of setting everything up for our application. Remember that you want to keep your station nice and clean and sanitary, so anytime you're not using something, you must close your containers and that you're disposing of all trash into your trash bag. All right, so here we go. We are going to start off by applying one bead at the free edge of the nail. Now we're going to be placing bead number two to the center. And a smaller bead near the base of nail, leaving the skin free from product. Again, this is the monomer and polymer over tip service for the Texas Cosmetology Practical Exam. Again, the purpose of the video is to help students feel more comfortable and to know what to expect the day of the test by any means. I know these videos will not be perfect, but I do know that it will help a lot of you guys out there feel a little bit better and more comfortable about testing. Once your application is down, the next step will be to smooth and even the acrylic and shape the nail with a file. Okay, sanitize your hands. Again, once you're done with the application, you can start closing anything that you no longer need. Okay, and again, since we're working with orderless, you do have to give these products a few extra minutes for them to dry. Any liquid that is left on your dish, you can throw it into your paper towel to get absorbed.
We're now buffing the nail to give it shine. We will then clean the nail to remove any debris or dust. Alright, so once you're done with your application, you can now continue with the cleanup process and putting things away. Okay, so you can grab your big bag that you started off with. Okay. Now, one thing that I want you guys to keep in mind is during the time that you are doing this application, okay, for the nail, it may be that a raider comes and stands next to you and watches you do this. They may or may not. I, I know you guys are going to be nervous and that's normal, but again, just do as you've been trained. And try to relax and keep going, okay? Your goal is to obviously finish within the 32 minutes that they give you. Okay, again, we are cleaning up putting everything back in our big, large bag. What I would suggest you guys do for this is once you're, you're, you're done cleaning, okay, you're gonna clean your station, get everything out of the way, but leave your tip out just in case if they did not come and watch you do this application, leave your tip out, all right, so that they can see it, all right? Don't forget to untape your bag your small trash bag that you taped to your station at the very beginning. You can even throw that into your large bag. Remember to re-clean everything. You want to disinfect your workstation once again. So again, a reminder, you're actually doing all of this before you raise your hand that you are done. Okay, now, what I, what I always like to say is to listen for specific instructions. If they say, please raise your hand when you are done with the application. Do not clean up until we tell you to, then you do that, okay? But if they don't specify to clean, excuse me, to raise your hand and then clean, don't do it, all right? You always want to clean your station before you raise your hand that you are done. Do not raise your hand that you are done and have everything out in the open and on.